We're just gonna go live, baby. We're gonna go live. What's up guys, it's Fatty Mansi here from Real Results Fitness. Before I begin and explain what we're gonna do, don't forget to like the video guys. It does help the channel grow, uh, helps show me that you guys like the content that's coming out. Otherwise, I'm just making videos to entertain myself. So make sure to like the video, uh, and if you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. Uh, in this channel, I teach you how to live properly, how to eat properly, and how to make some serious gains naturally. Anyways guys, in this video, what we're gonna be talking about, uh, what we're gonna be doing, we're gonna be going through a little bit of a leg day. Uh, it is my deload week, so um, not gonna be going too heavy uh, on some things, maybe leg press, but that's about it. Uh, going about one set less than what I normally do on everything. Uh, but it's primarily gonna be just a, a day to move and, and continue moving in the weight room. Um, I'm gonna start with about 20 minutes of cardio, 20, 25 minutes, and I'm gonna end with 20, 25 minutes of cardio because I got some makeup work to do from earlier in the week. And I'm not gonna be going too heavy on everything. So if my energy is drained, it's not a big deal. But anyways, guys, I just hopped on the road. Uh, catch you guys inside. Uh, a, few, a few of you guys have been reaching out to me in DM uh, through Instagram. If you don't follow me, follow me. I'll put it somewhere over here. Um, and I made a post recently. Uh, some of you guys want to see how, you know, got my legs bigger, how I got my legs kind of strong post-surgery, like without uh, squats. For those of you that are new to the channel or don't know, I've had uh, ACL and Achilles surgery and uh, basically had to start from the ground up, like, uh, after surgery and not walking on it your legs like half the size but uh, maybe we'll make a full video on that coming soon for now headed to the gym catch you guys inside and uh, yeah, that's it it's about my rock star. guys so uh as usual for my uh for any of my lifts actually i always like to start with some kind of a compound movement uh for those of you guys that don't know what a compound movement is it's a uh it's a workout or an exercise that's going to work multiple muscles at one time so the leg press is going to do that uh if you guys notice i have my feet a lot lower uh than most people do and that's okay if it does not bother your knees. Uh, so sometimes when I do this, it does bother my knees. Other times it does not. Um, so you just kind of got to feel it out. I worked up to this weight. I didn't just hop into it. If you guys watch my videos, uh, you know that's how I like to train is I uh, work up to a, a heavy weight. Um, so from there, uh, I moved on to uh, hip thrusts or glute bridges, whatever you guys want to call them. And, you know, I was surprised how how easy, I guess you could say, that this light, this weight was. Um, it's 315, but I remember leading up to it, I thought it was going to be real heavy. The worst part <laughs> is actually just the setup. So it's a struggle just to get set up. But after that, um, the weight does not feel bad. Uh, I think I went for uh, five to six reps on this. As I mentioned earlier in the video, guys, uh, this is my deload week. So the weight stayed uh, fairly close to what I normally do. Uh, but I'm doing less reps and uh, one to two less sets on everything. So even though the weight's still fairly heavy, I'm not doing as much volume. Um, you can still uh, kind of go heavier on a deload week. Some people need a complete deload week, uh, but you can still work around the same amount of weight and uh, drop a set or two and uh, still consider that a deload. Uh, because some people like myself uh, love to be in the gym um, and love to work out. And then if, if you're not there, uh, you feel like you're completely falling off. So 
a way to recover during like a rest period or a deload week is to do that. Just drop uh, a set or two and drop some reps and you could do around the same amount of weight. So that way it feels like you're still getting work in. But I did some leg extensions and uh, that's how I finished my workout. If you guys are looking for some structure in your workout program, I have two programs and I'll put them in the link down below. The six week fat furnace and the 28 day beach body. Uh, other than that guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to leave a thumbs up down below, uh, comment, subscribe, and uh, once you let me know what your favorite leg workout is down below in the comments. I'll see you guys on the next video.